In this video, we are going to find the value of x in this given equation where x belongs to the positive real numbers. Since we have square root in these three terms, we can write x as square root x multiplied by square root x. Now we have square root x common in these two terms and square root x plus 2 common in these two terms. Taking square root x common in the first two terms gives us square root x multiplied by square root x plus square root x plus 1 plus square root x plus 2 multiplied by we have square root x remaining here square root x plus we have square root x plus 1 remaining here square root x plus 1 this is equals to 2 now we have square root x plus square root x plus 1 common in these two terms hence taking square root x plus square root x plus 1 common gives us square root x is remaining here square root x plus square root x plus 2 is remaining here square root x plus 2 and this is equals to 2. We can remove the square root of square root x plus square root x plus 2 by multiplying both sides of the equation by square root of x plus 2 minus square root x to multiply by square root of x plus 2 minus square root x. Now this is in the form of a plus b multiplied by a minus b where a is equals to square root of x plus 2 and b is equals to square root of x and this is equals to a square minus b square. So this gives such square root of x plus square root of x plus 1 multiplied by a square which is square root of x plus 2 the whole square minus b square which is square root of x to the whole square equals to 2 multiplied by square root of x plus 2 minus square root of x so this gives us square root of x plus square root of x plus 1 multiplied by square root of x plus 2 to the whole square is equals to x plus 2 because the square root and the square will cancel out minus square root x to the whole square is x equals to 2 multiplied by square root of x plus 2 minus square root of x here plus x and minus x will cancel out to give 2 so this gives us square root of x plus square root of x plus 1 multiplied by 2 equals to 2 multiplied by square root of x plus 2 minus square root x. Now 2 on both sides will cancel out to give square root x plus square root of x plus 1 equals to square root of x plus 2 minus square root x adding square root x to both sides and subtracting square root of x plus 1 to both sides gives 2 square root x equals to square root of x plus 2 minus square root of x plus 1. Now taking square to both sides of the equation gives us 4x equals to this is in the form of a minus b whole square a minus b whole square which is equals to a square plus b square minus 2ab hence 4x equals to a square which is square root of x plus 2 square which will give x plus 2 plus b square which is square root of x plus 1 which will give x plus 1 minus 2 multiplied by a b a is 
square root of x plus 2 and b is square root of x plus 1. So this gives us 4x equals to x plus x is equals to 2x and 2 plus 1 is equals to 3 minus 2 multiplied by x plus 2 multiplied by square root of x plus 1. Rearranging the equation gives 2 square root of x plus 2 multiplied by square root of x plus 1 equals to 3 minus 2x. Now taking square to both sides of the equation gives 4 multiplied by x plus 2 multiplied by x plus 1 equals 2. This is in the form of a minus b whole square which is a square which is 3 square plus b square which is 2x square minus 2 multiplied by 3 multiplied by 2x. So this gives us 4 multiplied by multiplying x plus 2 and x plus 1 gives x square plus x plus 2x plus 2 equals to 3 square is 9 plus 2x square is 4x square minus 12x. So this gives us 4x square plus x plus 2x is 3x multiplied by 4 equals to 12x plus 4 multiplied by 2 is 8 equals to 9 plus 4x square minus 12x. Now 4x square from both sides will cancel out. Adding both sides of the equation by 12x and subtracting 8 gives us 12x plus 12x 24x equals to 9 minus 8 equals to 1. Now dividing both sides by 24 gives us x equals to 1 divided by 24. So this is our answer.